<clears throat> I am making you a video today. Um, may or may not do one after work tomorrow, I'm not sure. Um, I've solved the problem as to why my camera is usually so shitty. It is the um, general level of light in my house. I'm sorry about um, like shit on my face and sick and sick means skin good. And does a sad panda on you, but anyway. Um, the, the reason it's so shit is because I have a very dim light bulb in here. Um, I'm going to smash the bulb um, by accident. Yet yeah, don't spin poi near lights. You will forget and break the fucking thing. So I, when I broke it, I just threw in a random bulb that I had. I was like, oh yeah, that's a, that's a bayonet bulb. That'll work. But yeah, it's really dim, so there's generally like really fucking dark in here. So I need to um, put a better light bulb in there. But doing your video today because I went to, pardon me, sorry, um, I went to the Salvation Army on my way back from um, the appointment with the, with Karis today. Um, I need to get new clothes, I need to get new pants, I need, like, I was going to go get cargo pants but I saw um, the Salvation Army was having a big sale and I was like, I don't know if they'll have what I'm after, but I'll go have a look anyway, and I didn't end up getting any new cargo pants. Um, but I got some stuff, and I figured I'd do the whole fashion parade for you. Because, yeah, some of the stuff I got is not generally my sort of thing, but I figure if I end up getting off my ass and going to a festival this year, it might count as festival there, I don't know. Um, probably to, like, um, one of the drinky things. It's not, maybe performance where... I oh, know it's slightly more dressy festival wear for me anyway, but yeah, I, on the way home I stopped in at Save Mart, which is where I got the new scarfy thing. I'm not sure it actually goes with what I'm wearing because you can see it's, there's not as much, I don't really wear warm colours because of the pink cheeks and the warm colours generally make me look horrendous, but it's got like the yellow and a bit of brown, orangey brown, fuck I can't remember, but it's more navy and the rest of this is more black a bit of orange in it, so yeah. maybe, maybe, or I'll find a, another headscarf or something that looks nice with it. It's really good for just keeping my hair out of the way without having to be bothered to do stuff to it. But anyway, I'll show you, before I show you what I'm wearing, I'll show you some of the other stuff that I got. Um, I got a this skirt, this is probably me, this is definitely generally me, it's um, about knee length on me and it's got a lot of it's got a lot of fabric and movement to it, and I'm sorry for the, like, really bright, but the sun is coming straight in my window. My window's north facing, it gets the sun all year round. Because I'm south of here, I just, like, you know, north facing, gets the sun all year round. And I got this, um, linen-y, canvas -y, light blue, three-quarter sleeve top, and that's definitely more me, so that'll be in regular usage this year and the neck should hopefully not make my bones look like horrendously huge because you know minimizing the dust area is sort of huge. Anyway so I've got more black top and I've got a little sparkly pretty that I got on oh, my nails. I've got zebra nails. Zebra nails or, or black nails or whatever that's just white with the black crackle. This is it. We kicked ass in the rugby and I feel like monochrome this one. So anyway, this is what I'm wearing. Stand back, stand back, stand back. Hi! I can move around. Woo! This is bizarre. But anyway, I saw this at the Sally's, this like rugby thing. I was like, oh my god, it's fucking awesome. I have to have it. I don't care. Look, it's all on my house. I feel like, oh. I, was like, I don't care if I have to, if I don't. I don't care if I don't normally wear black, I mean orange anyway, you know, something different. And then I was like, oh, the air sores aren't in there, it's got all this, it doesn't cover all, it doesn't like wrap. Normally with sarong things, they go like from one side and they go like around and come back, so you've got people with that, so you'll say. I was like, shit, it's got a bit tight. So I went and had a look around and they had these horrendous wet look bleeding things, which are really unflattering. And these are like really baggy up around here as well. The person who had these must have had quite a bit um, around, quite a bit of extra around here. So I'm using the 
tie to sort of hold that tuck in. They're just appalling. Look, they've got their fucking pockets on the arse. Oh god, they look really bad. You know, wet look tights are just disgusting. But since I'm only like, you only see the leg, I think that's okay. It's sort of endurable, but um, just bleh. Which is why I will not wear them very often because just, oh, it's disgusting. I mean, they're not. They've got like little patches of the reflective stuff, so it sort of looks like like fake snake skin or fake crocodile skin. So yeah, that's okay. So I think you know if you're, you're hooping away off on stage in one of these things, will look too bad. Or if you're yeah, strolling around some um, bee events, I don't know. I call them the hippies, but yeah, the the the, the, the free shop, occupy the octagon. Um, Freegan, dumpster diving type people, they're really awesome people, but they just, they just, you know, just... <coughs> the root got really dry. Okay. I'm not coughing up quite as much shit as I was yesterday, but if I talk too much and my throat gets really dry, I just start hacking. I'm using that word a lot. I don't know why. That's one of the. It's this um, vita, vita, vita quench, vita fresh, one of those things. It's like a. It's like juice, but it's like the, the Raro juice mix, but it's um, got pretty much no sugar in it and it's got extra vitamin C and stuff, so it's full of artificial sweeteners. Skip any day. But, you know, I force a whole bunch of vitamin C into me and rest a lot and I have Ribena and I was like, oh, there's a big scandal if you, I have Ribena. <clears throat> I have Ribena. There was a big scandal when um, some kids, high school kids, did a science experiment because the Ribena is all like, um, like they, they were claimed, they're saying on the ads that black currants have four times the vitamin C volume so people would look at this black currant juice and assume that it had four times the vitamin C of orange juice. They were not specifically making the claim that their product had four times the vitamin C, but they were implying because one of the ingredients, the flavouring of the ingredient, happened to have, you know, more than the others. But some girls decided to find out, just a science experiment in high school, decided to find out exactly how much vitamin C was in it. It was fuck all. And so Rabina got in the shits. They got in. They were like fucking in and with it up to hear the, the, the Commerce Commission and the claims, advertising claims people, and oh my god, they, their fucking responses and damage control was so funny to watch. <coughs> Sorry. And um, it was just fucking hysterical watching the back up, and I was like, because mum would always give us this when we were little and we were sick and like we had a cold or something. We'd always get Ribena because oh, it's always a vitamin C, it's good for you. And I was like, I don't care if it's good for me, it tastes good. And I was like, you know, the placebo effect. The placebo effect is handy, so yeah. And I was like, oh, Ribena. Oh, the supermarket says, oh, Ribena. Oh, I'll have some placebos, please. And <coughs> I looked at it and I was like, aww. You put vitamin C in it now, it's not a placebo. I want my placebo. Yeah, it's now got 50% of your daily intake of vitamin C per serve. And I thought, hmm, I'm sorry, this is really overexposed on this side. Oh my god. Um, I'll try something. There we go, that's a bit better. <laughs> You can see my messy, messy chair of projects. <coughs> and crap. Yeah, my lounge is very messy. My place is just very messy. Um, no, it's not much better, but oh well. I'm gonna go and take this this horrible outfit off and put on something comfortable and proceed to drink my longer pursue Bowie Wibina. Um, okay, so that was my fashion show. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm sorry about the horrendous tights. They're just disgusting. Oh my. Oh my.
my god, if it hadn't been like 50% off, uh, no it wasn't 50, it was 25% off because like they had a big a big sale thing going and you, you got your stuff and you went up to counter and you took a piece of paper out of the bin and it was all, hmm, what random discount did you get? And I got 25%. And I was like, sweet. And she's like, if they weren't like three bucks, I wouldn't have gotten them because, you know, and you know, new clothes are shiny and all that, you know, make you, make you feel pretty. <laughs> Yes, make pretty. Oh, so pretty, pretty in the tummy. I don't know. I don't know the words to that song. I should know the words. So yes. I'm gonna go. Okay, but I know my washing is nearly done. Yes. The uh, Yes. The washing machine has just stopped trying to take off through the roof, so I'm gonna go. Oh, and the landlord came and fixed the roof today. He and his mate got up there with their fucking sticky roofing construction tape stuff and taped over the spot where it was leaking. Like, Fuck, can I be all of them this time? Fuse, cross my fingers, cross my fingers, cross my fucking fingers. Ah. Yes, I hope that's all the leaks. Because hopefully it'll be like March and I can get out of this place and go find a new flat and yes, live with awesome people and have more money to put aside so I can actually start thinking properly about travelling instead of going oh, rapidly to travel. Oh my god, it was horrible, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm holding it out at arm's length now. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at my music and DVDs and all my old textbooks and stuff. <laughs> okay, um, shit, I need to get that rest of it. Okay, so I'm gonna go. Put my wash now. Change your oh, oh my god, I like the skirt. If it hadn't been this fucking skirt, I wouldn't have gotten the tights. But I refuse to go to, like, like, Supre or something and spend twenty, thirty dollars on a pair of leggings. I'm just like, that? So yeah, three bucks. I can forgive them their hideousness. Oh, they look really cool and I've got some like decent definition on my corpse. They look so fucking cool. It's like, rah, I, am a, I have pythons for legs, rah, so they more size. <laughs> <coughs> okay, refill that. Um, have a good afternoon. I might see you tomorrow. If not, take care of yourself. Have a good Friday, Saturday, Thursday, or whatever the fuck it is in the time zone. I don't know. You guys are all over the place. You're all like way back in time. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Have a good day. Love you all.